Hey everyone, welcome back to Web Squadron. We got asked a question on one of our YouTube videos from someone called Nazi Cynthia. Hey Naz, uh, thanks for your lovely message about we should have more subscribers. Yes, I agree. We should have loads more subscribers. Uh, her question was, can we please make a tutorial on continuous scrolling text in Elementor without any plugin? So I'm thinking of like a news ticker that scrolls, you know, across the screen or up and down, or maybe even like, like a marquee, they sometimes call it. And that actually is a clue to the solution. So let's have a look at that right now. Right, this is actually simpler than it looks. Um, so I'm just going to do a search for HTML in Elementor, okay? You got the custom HTML, but just use the one that comes of Elementor. So I'm just going to drop that into a section. Nothing else fancy there. Now, I probably should explain something. Normally, when you do your text, you're going to use like a text editor or a header even. Okay, so let's just add in a text editor just underneath over here. And let's just pretend I'm going to use this item here. Okay, I'm actually going to just break, yeah, we'll leave it as it is at the moment. There's my text. And normally you might have more text or more headers, whatever. What you've got to do is kind of take your text that you normally would have entered into here or just add it on the fly. And what you now need to do is add it to your HTML. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to add it in straight away. OK, so there's my text added in. But what you do right at the beginning is you have to do um, uh, the less than symbol. There's an official symbol for it, bracket, something, whatever, whatever. And you want to type mar key. And I hope that's clear on the screen. There's an M-A-R-Q-U-E-E. -E. And you want to end it with backslash mar or however that looks like so. I don't know if you've noticed, I've actually got a mistake here. I've, I've just added it in there as well. So let me just get rid of that. And instantly, by having marquee at the beginning, and then I've got my wording in the middle, and then backslash or forward slash marquee at the end, it is now scrolling on my screen. I mean, let me just change this to be about uh, a 500 just to make a point of what it does. I'm gonna click update again. You gotta click update because it doesn't always work by the way. Um, there you go, look, the word's now coming across. And what I could do is I could actually separate it. So I might decide that if I just go into here, I'm gonna use the pipe symbol, which is like that. So I might you know, wanna separate some of the items off because they might be different types of information coming across. And you'll see in a moment, there you go, there's the pipe. At the lorem ipsum dollar sit amit pipe, consecutor apis the dissona elit elis telus pipe. I don't know Latin, don't quote me on any of that. Okay, and that is basically a really, really simple way of how you can add it in. Now, there are ways that you can actually change it to actually scroll up and down as well. And to do that, we have to add a bit more um, code into this, right? So, right here, where it says marquee, before you get the greater than symbol, it'll look like that on your screen if I put it the right way around. I'm just gonna put a space before then, add direction up now. So what I've got is marquee direction up in speech marks. And look, it's scrolling up. If I now put uh, down, it goes down. If I go left, it goes left. If I go right, it goes right. You gotta love it, right? So I will make sure I put this code inside uh, the description. If, it's, if I can't get it in the description, because sometimes YouTube doesn't like it, it'll be the very first comment. So marquee. Um, so if you don't want to, if you don't care about the positioning, get rid of that. Just have it like this. Uh, just make sure it doesn't close it off. It always seems to close off when I don't want it to. Don't know why it does that. But anyway, look, that is like a really simple way of how you could have a news ticker. And you can position that wherever you want. I hope that helped, uh, Nazi Cynthia. Like, subscribe, and see you soon.